you guys. It's chat again. I know it's been a while. Um, I've had a lot going on. I've moved house again. Moved in with my girlfriend. So, you know, that's been one of those things you just have to do eventually. And, um, yeah, just getting used to sharing the space and um, working out, you know, territorial stuff. No, it's all good. Um, and then, yeah, just getting in the work and I've had a lot of personal things going on, but but also a lot of um, exciting things as well. Um, I've enrolled in a new diploma for digital and interactive games. So I'm really excited about that. Um, basically, it's an 18 month course. I'm doing it externally because there's no local campus here to support the course. Um, and the awesome thing is they're gonna send me um, a 17 inch Alienware gaming laptop um, when I've completed uh, the first unit and I make it past a certain date, you know, just to make sure that I'm actually legitimately wanting to do this. So that's exciting. And um, so at the end of it, I should basically be able to make my own games um, on PC and iOS uh, that uses the Unreal Development Kit. Uh, so that's awesome. Like I love the, what the Unreal Engine has done. Some of my favorite games uh, have used the Unreal Engine, so I hope at least I can maybe follow in some kind of those awesome footsteps. Um, got a couple of ideas running around what kind of game I should make. Uh, in recent times, if, hell, if I can come up with a flappy bird, holy crap. I can guarantee you that I won't be taking it down because I can't handle the comments. If it's earning me 50 grand a day, like he was reportedly earning, man, yeah, people could say it's the shittest game on the planet, but hell, if I can roll out of bed, check my bank account, there's another 50 grand in there, I'll just easily roll back to bed, I wouldn't give a crap. Um, but I'm not really, I'm not really after it for the money, but um, I'd really want to make my own games, and um, I've got a lot of characters that I can do stuff with, so this might be the right avenue for me to actually use my characters uh, in some kind of creative way. If you don't know, um, I'm Australian. Um, so, you know, there's some really good um, developers in this country that have made some really popular games. Oh, the guys that made uh, Fruit Ninja, they're Australian. Um, you know, they're multi-millionaires now, so, you know, that goes to show uh, what you can do in Half Creek Studios. Um, you know, they, they make their own games, and I, I play them. They're really good. You know, I tend to buy the Australian apps or the games. You know, I want to support um, developers in this country. So, if I can um, get to the point where I'm making my own mobile games like that and work out a strategy to get them marketed right so they can be seen and um, made popular, um, it's very difficult because you know there's billions of apps out there on the iOS store. So, um, who knows? But it's all happening. I've, I've only been doing this course for about a month now, so 17 months to go. Uh, you know, I've got to set myself some high standards and high goals. Otherwise, if you know, I've really got, you know, so you're selling yourself short. In other words, so uh, yeah, got to do it. Got to do it. Looking forward to it. Also, I bought myself one of these, the Ouroboros, I think it's called. Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, bought this to use with the Alienware laptop when it gets here. Um, I figured if I'm going to be making games, I want to have a decent gaming mouse to experiment with. Um, I don't know if I'm going to need it, but I thought, what the hell, um, it's a good excuse to get one. And I just might find some uses with it, depending on the game I'm going to make. Um, so yeah, I'm pretty stoked about that. Um, I haven't used it, I've just opened the box to have a look at it. I'm really, really happy with it, so I can't wait to use this thing. So tell me guys, um, what kind of game would you like to see uh, me make in future? Um, I know 18 months is a long way away, but I've only just started the course, so I'm throwing around ideas. Um, I'm not entirely sure at what point we'll actually start developing the game, but um, if, you, if you guys have some ideas to throw my way, uh, just let me know what kind of games you would like to see made, or what your favourite games are, and um, you know, I can get some ideas rolling around in my own head. And um, I just want to make some good fun games. I'm going to make some games that I want to play. Uh, ideally, that's the stuff I want to do, is make the games that I love and I love to play. But if there's other games out there that you guys really like and you'd like to see more of, um, 
if I can do it, no guarantees. Like I've never made a game in my life, but this is the first step. So uh, who knows? Uh, I might do really well. So yeah, let me know. Leave a comment. What kind of game you like, or what your favourite games are. So please leave a comment. Um, subscribe. Like this video. It really helps. Uh, I'd really, really appreciate it. Um, hopefully now that I'm more settled, and I've said it enough times, but now that I'm more settled, I will hope to be uh, making more of an effort on my channel and on my page, um, especially my web page. Um, this is a great outlet for me. Hopefully, me sharing what I like, um, you guys might like it too, and you know, we can communicate that way. And hell, you know, if, if I really start getting some response, it would just really encourage me to do more of this. Um, but I'll be uh, documenting my progress during my course for those that are interested. Um, just my thoughts and struggles with this gaming course. And um, yeah, if you guys want to, you know, see how I'm going every now and then, just tune in. And um, remember to, to subscribe. So when I do upload a video, you'll get notified. And yeah, just um, keep on keeping on, guys. Um, and I'll see you next time, hopefully in another video coming up very soon. See ya.